Hello, welcome to Technolinux. Um, uh, this is a video regarding uh, routing your Samsung Galaxy S4. So um, you are watching this video because you want to root Samsung Galaxy S4. Uh, let me give you a slight introduction of uh, what routing is about. Uh, you might be aware that Samsung is uh, not the real manufacturer of Android. Actually, Google makes it, and the stock Android is over written by I, mean, I can say the some of the features and tweaks are overwritten by Samsung and some are added by Samsung to make some changes here and there and in this process there are lo lot uh, lots of bloatware added into the operating system and these bloatware stop you from using the uh, full capacity or the full functionality of a mobile so if you want to remove this bloatware you have to root your mobile so for the Samsung Galaxy S4 the first step is as follows so this is the first step uh, for the first step you need to download Samsung's uh, USB drivers onto your desktop uh, these are available on this link which I'll be giving you down below in the description make sure you download this and uh, it will take you to this site where uh, you can download the Samsung USB driver on your desktop once you download them make sure you install them by uh, uh, this is a zip zip file so you'll need a winzip extractor for this uh, make sure you have it if you don't have uh, I, uh, you can download it uh, from the website or from the Google you can search it out and you can download it okay so once you have the winzip and I hope you'll have it uh, now extract this folder and install the files from it on your desktop so after installing the files the next step and the second step for your routing will be taking your mobile in the hand take your Samsung Galaxy S4 and uh, tap on the uh, notification uh, pull down the notification bar and from that tap on the settings option when you'll tap tap on the settings option it will take you to settings menu from there click on the about device option after the about device option you have clicked click on build number repeatedly until the device pops up a notification saying you are now a developer so once the notification comes that you are now a developer stop tapping on the build number repeatedly the next step would be to go into the developer options and click on it once you click on it You'll, you'll go to a menu where you'll see debugging option go into the debugging option uh, below the debugging option you'll see USB debugging click on that so now you are all set to root your Samsung Galaxy S4 the next step would be to plug your device in to your desktop via USB cable wait for the drivers to install once the driver is installed the next step is to download the application called Moto Chopper okay guys so this is the XDA link which I was talking about I'll be giving you down below in the description make sure you download this uh, Moto Chopper application from this link once you have downloaded the Moto Chopper application uh, make sure you extract it and once again you'll need the winzip extract to okay guys so extract it onto a folder folder in your desktop on your, on your computer uh, once you have done that open that folder and you'll get a run.bat run.bat file click on that file and when you'll click on that file when you click on that file you'll see a pop-up coming up on your Samsung Galaxy S4 screen it will read like this the computer's RSA key is fingerprint is um, as as it as it will show something like this like this and uh, then you'll you have to click on OK just press on OK and boom your Samsung Galaxy S4 is rooted disconnect your Samsung Galaxy S4 from your computer go into the app drawer and check the super user application if it's present you're all set to go but if it's not uh, if it, it should be present ideally 
and if still you are not uh, if still you are not uh, confirmed that you are rooted just download this application from play store i'll be giving the link of this application also below down in the description and if you are if you want to check whether you are rooted or not just download this application from the play store and uh, by this you can check whether you are rooted or not and uh, so this was the whole process guys uh, hopefully your samsung galaxy s4 will be rooted and you'll be use you'll be able to use the bounties of rooting so thanks for watching this video once again and uh, if you have any difficulties you can uh, write down below in the dis in the comment section and uh, please subscribe the channel if you like this video if it helped you in any way uh, thanks for watching this video once again and see you in the next video